This is Michelle Stevens at New York One. Coming up next, is adoption right for you? No, we're not talking about adopting a baby, but how about a dog? Well, Linda Thompson interviewed a New Yorker who decided to do just that. Here's Linda with a story. Meet Susan Goldberg, a lawyer who decided to adopt a dog from a new no-kill rescue adoption agency called Woof Refuge. I saw her, and she was just the cutest thing I had ever seen. I mean, just adorable. Just adorable. She was so cute. My husband and I just talked a lot about how we always wanted a dog. We wanted a dog. We really wanted a dog. I'm allergic to dogs, so, um, but I, but not to dogs that have hair. So I, you know, thought, okay, we have to go to a breeder. But Susan did not have to go to a breeder. She could adopt a rescue dog and without compromising her health or her wallet. In fact, she was able to find a four-year-old schnoodle. What's a schnoodle, you ask? A schnoodle is a half poodle, half schnauzer mix. A schnoodle can cost up to $1,000 from a breeder. But from Woof Refuge, schnoodles and other hypoallergenic breeds are available for much less, no more than about $300. Susan was able to adopt her dream dog while still saving a dog's life. I was so excited. I was like on just head over heels excited. Just I was I was just my heart was pounding. <laughs> Let's just put it. She that. just came rushing right out, came right over to me and jumped up on me with her little paws and started, you know, licking my face. <laughs> I just had to bring her home with me that was that was all you know she just she, she completely uh, I fell in love with her um, but aren't there drawbacks to adopting a dog people often wonder what kind of background does the dog have are there lingering emotional issues that can crop up for the new owner we asked Susan these questions buttons she does not like buttons. Um, if she sees somebody wearing buttons, she barks. <laughs> so, you know, we make adjustments for, for people in our families who we love. And so it's the same for the dog. So, you know, um, like right now, like I, I could never wear, wear these buttons in front of her. This is Linda Thompson of New York One.